Hello everyone, this is Still Size 6 and thank you so much for tuning into another video. This video is going to be a focus of how to increase your eyelashes and make them grow. If you haven't checked out my video regarding Latisse and the introduction to everything you need to know about Latisse, I've been using the generic form of Latisse which is called CarePros and that video is going to cover a lot of questions that you may have regarding that particular product which is an eyelash growth serum which originally started out as a, a medication for people who had glaucoma. I know but it works and I'm sure you've heard about it all over the TV and all over the internet. It is outside of what I've done with using the Latisse. The second video is an update. I'm going to leave that link also. Okay? I used it. It increased my lashes probably about 50%. But this video is for those who A, use Latisse or want to use Latisse and want to get the growth that you would use from this particular product but you need you want an extra kick so for me I use Latisse and I've increased my lashes by approximately 50 percent in growth and also in thickness and doing this thing actually increased them an additional 25 percent okay and if you choose not to use Latisse and you're just looking to increase your lashes the length of them and the thickness then this video is for you also because you can use this and you don't have to use it hand in hand with Latisse. You can use it with or without. Now there's going to be two things that are totally required with being able to increase your lashes this way and possibly a third which is an option. It's optional but it's not completely necessary. So let me tell you my story. You know I usually have a story before I begin to show you things and this video is no different so the story is that my husband went to go he, he's a serviceman he went to service a young woman's house who was either of Arabic or Egyptian I don't remember the ethnicity and I suppose it's not really really important but she did indicate that this is what they do in their country to increase their lashes. Eyelashes were a sign of beauty just like it is over here. It's no different over here. So they pay close attention to the eyelashes and increasing the growth. So, sorry, had a scratch. My husband said that her lashes were really, really long and um, he said that he was writing out some paperwork for her and he just could not help but look at her eyes. And um, she said to him, she knew immediately, she said to him, um, you're staring at my eyelashes, aren't you? And she says, I know, they're really long. And she said, in my country, we use shampoo and conditioner on our eyes. Now, at the time my husband knew, I was, I just started using the CarePros, the generic version of Latisse. So he comes home and he tells me this. And my first thought was, I do want long lashes. But I'm not putting shampoo and conditioner on my eyes. Is she nuts? Okay, no, that's not really what happened. But it was a little bit of a milder version. I just was like, I'm not going to put shampoo and conditioner in my eyes. Like, all at the cost of beauty. And it came back to me, as things usually do, a couple weeks later. I started thinking about it. And I started doing some research online and looking. And couldn't find anybody that did this. Nobody. Nobody online. Like, there was nothing out there. I googled freaking everything when it came to shampoo and hair conditioner on eyelashes. So I dismissed it. And it came back to me a couple months later again. I was using my Care Prost and I was happy with the results, but I wanted more. Isn't that what usually happens? Like you do your hair and it gets longer and you're on your hair journey and you want more, you want it longer or your skin is clearing up and you're like, wow, this is really nice. But you want more. You want flawless skin. You're losing weight and you're like, gosh, this is fabulous. But I want more. Like, I want to tone myself. And I mean, always, you know, I'm no different. I'm female. There's not a whole lot of satisfaction. I'm constantly wanting more. I'm ready for the next step. So I wanted my lashes even longer. And long they did get. I started doing this maybe about three weeks ago, two or three weeks ago, and I see results already. Okay, so this is what I started doing. Well, first of all, let me tell you, this is what you need. 
everybody talks about Vaseline, putting Vaseline on your eyelashes at night. And yeah, this does actually strengthen your lashes. Um, again, I said it in my previous video and I'll say it again. If you follow me, you know how I feel about petroleum. I hate this crap, okay? But I've been using it on my eyelashes and I use this sometimes. I switch it up. This is like a wax. Spoke about this in the previous video too. It's like a wax that you, uh, this is what I use to train my lashes. It's a heavier product than the Vaseline, but nonetheless, it is pretty much Vaseline. So I use the petroleum or the Dax usually about twice, maybe two or three times a week. I don't use it every night. So the other product that I use is a conditioner. Now this is really important because this conditioner that I have here I got from Whole Foods. Whole Foods is pretty much the only place that I get my shampoos and conditioners from. And the reason why is because the Whole Foods has a whole line of hair care products which I discovered about six months ago that are non-sulfate they don't have paraffins they don't have any chemicals in them this is the 365 which is the Whole Foods product this is the line of products that they manufacture and it specifically indicates on it no parabens no sodium lauryl sulfate sulfate no sodium laureth sulfate no artificial fragrance and uh, they don't animal test either uh, FYI this is the conditioner. This is the herbal mint. It smells so good. They also have a citrus and they have a few other flavors. If you don't choose to get the 365, you can pretty much get any conditioner that also does not contain those ingredients. This is important. This is key because you don't want to, of course, this is your eyes, okay? You want to be very careful even with it not having these ingredients, to not put this stuff in your eyes. So originally what I was doing was I would go in the shower and I would close my eyes and I would put the conditioner on and then I would leave it on while I wash myself throughout my shower. My shower is usually probably a little less than 10 minutes. And then I would keep my eyes closed the whole time and then I would rinse it out and I would get out of the shower and go about my day. I felt like that wasn't enough. I wanted more. And I did notice a little bit of growth from doing that. But then what I started doing uh, probably about a week ago, and this is when I got the most growth, I started taking the conditioner and applying it to my eyes. I mean, I can, you can use a Q-tip or you can use your fingers. And all you want to do is take a little bit of the product and you want to apply it to your eyelash, eyelashes just like this just apply it to your eyelashes being very careful not to get in your eye and don't use too much because it will drip into your eye I have not gotten any in my eye amazingly and then I leave it on and I got out of my I get out of the shower and I just do whatever I need to do and I leave it on for about an hour then I rinse it out that's it I've been doing it for about a week a week and a half and it's a huge difference. Um, I'm not exaggerating. I, I'm really not exaggerating. I can tell you that using the Latisse and this, it's kicked it up about another 25% in addition to the 50% that the Latisse already increased it. I mean, amazing, amazing. I'm shocked I, I did not do this months ago when I found out about it. And in fact, I'm shocked I haven't done it years ago. I'm shocked more people don't do this. I mean, it's hair conditioner. Why wouldn't it increase the growth? of our lashes considering that there's hair follicles here too. I don't know if this product also increases it but I use a shampoo as well and I take the shampoo and I simply it's again it's sulfate free doesn't have any chemicals in it and I simply close my eyes gently gently rub away because I don't want to scrub my lashes this is a very delicate area um, so wrinkles are going to form here if you are not careful and you don't take special care of the the skin around your eyes. So I gently, gently close my eyes and I will wipe away. Then I rinse it out. Then I apply the conditioner. So I don't want to bore you. I'm going to be posting some before and after pictures as well in this video as I did in the previous video with my results from the, the care post. Um, but I will show you a very quick view of what it looks like in case you did not view the previous video and you don't care to.
brown skin You know I love your brown skin I can't tell where yours begins I can't tell where mine is Brown skin Up against my brown skin So as always, if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them below. And everyone, I just want to thank you so much for watching. And please don't forget to rate and subscribe. Have a wonderfully blessed evening. Brown skin, you know I love your brown skin. I can't tell where yours begins. Can't tell where mine is Brown skin Up against my brown skin So they pay close attention to increasing My closet just threw up Wow